Hi everyone, Martha Murray, uh, Sensi Star Director, and I got my warmer of the month yesterday, and I'm so excited. Uh, Katie did a promo a couple weeks ago for the warmer of the month to hopefully get every one of you enrolled. So I got mine yesterday. I went, went and make, made sure as soon as Katie said that, I went and made sure I was all enrolled because you can uh, cancel or downgrade just to the center of the month or be enrolled in the warmer and center of the month. So I love that option that we have. So I got mine yesterday and I just wanted to share with you for a little bit. Um, our, our pumpkin warmer here is eight and a half inches tall, first of all. It's Harvest Pumpkin, the name split, uh, slipped my mind since we go live, everything leaves, you know, as soon as you go live and somebody's recording you. But anyways, Harvest Pumpkin is eight and a half inches tall and it is an element warmer. And I love that it's stackable, it's so cute. So it has a little warming plate there. And um, so I love, 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 love this. I think this is gonna be a huge seller. If you're doing shows and parties and events, uh, people are gonna love this. This is something they can leave out till Thanksgiving. So, and you can still enroll in this today, even if you're not currently enrolled, go enroll today and you will still get the warmer instead of the month. And then I absolutely love farm stand pumpkin. Mm. Oh, it smells amazing. And with the warmer and sun of the month, you get 10 bars of this. This is awesome for your parties and shows and events to, you know, to have in your purse as you're going about to, to, to see friends and family, to church or whatever. Have some bars in your purse and sell them while you're on the go. That's what I do. I love to have these handy with me wherever I go. Um, you get 10 of them. Um, my grandbaby has one of them. She absolutely loves Sensi, so who knows where it is right now. But you get 10 of these bars. Uh, you get the room spray, farm stand pumpkin room spray. Uh, great to have uh, through Thanksgiving as well. And then you get a party tester and one of our little mini testers. Oh, I just, I absolutely love this scent. I'm not actually a huge uh, food scent person, but I absolutely love this one because it has uh, pumpkin, cinnamon stick, pu um, fresh apple, cinnamon stick, pumpkin, and caramel in it all blended together. Uh, with the warmer of the month as well, you get 50 of these uh, brochures, and I love these uh, great little um, brochure to have with your info on, and then it has the other warmer and sun of the month uh, attached as well. And these are great to stick around on bulletin boards, pass them out instead of doing a catalog all the time. Nice to have these as well. And then you get the set stickers as well that I love, rub and sniff. I love to put these on envelopes and different things I mail out. Um, sometimes I put them on here. On my samples, I'll, I'll put these on my little samples that I make. This is another great reason to have the scent of the month is to make samples to have to pass out to people. Uh, so I love to have that little sample. So that's our, our little promo there for the warmer and scent of the month. Uh, I wanted to share that with you. Oh, the value is $110.30. That's the value of all this. You can get it for only $70. And guess what? There's more. <laughs> you also earn PRV. You get $70 uh, of uh, PRV from this as well, and you get your commission. So that's an amazing, amazing investment for your business, and also it's a tax write-off. So I love that little uh, little note there. All right, uh, some other things I wanted to share with you as well is our holiday brochures are available October 1st. And just a little tidbit, um, as soon as those holiday brochures come out and you have those in your hands, make sure you, you start taking pre-orders. Our holiday warmers, several of them sell out almost every single year. So take pre-orders for the holiday warmers. So as soon as they're available, you have orders to put in for them. Um, my per personal prediction is special delivery, which is the little red pickup truck, truck, and that little Christmas tree in the bed of the truck is removable. Um, so that one will be a huge sellout. Let it snow. And the uh, snow day decorative scene, I think, will all be huge sellouts. So uh, make sure you start collecting orders for those. Uh, also, our, our, for anyone that is participating in our Rockstar Leadership Program, Mark's video is up. We had a little bit of a problem there, but it's all uploaded now, and you can go and watch it. Um, so thank you, Mark, for recording that video for us. Uh, just some things to keep you on track. Make sure your PWS uh, story is updated. Make sure you have some joined brochures. Those were some of your challenges. Make sure you read through chapter four this week um, and then make a three-year business plan. 
Uh, also, t today is Tuesday. Tuesday is Tuesday training. Um, every Tuesday on the training center of your workstation is a training call. If you can go and you can register and listen to it live and uh, earn free um, things from the Sensi Family Store if you listen to it live. Or if you're working or you're not available to listen to it, it is recorded. Always recorded. So make sure you are investing in your business. Um, one other thing, we have 11 days left in September. 11 days to get your orders in, to have the best month ever. 11 days to share the $49 join opportunity if you're in the U.S., um, if you're in some of our other regions, obviously that's a little bit different, but make sure you are sharing this amazing sense of opportunity with everyone. Um, if you feel like you are having some difficulty in your business, I just had a few thoughts I wanted to share with you. Um, somebody that had, had inspired me shared this, and so I want to pass it on to you. Um, we had, there's two words to, to, to make sure that you have a, a successful sense business. And those two words are consistency and dedication consistency and dedication. Are you consistent in your business? Are you consistent in working your business every single day? Every single day you need to turn the key and open your door for business. Are you also, are you consistent in the things that you're passionate about also? Your marriage, your spiritual life, uh, eating healthy, working out. Are you consistent in these things? Um, because if you're not being consistent in these things, you're not going to get the return of the investment on these things. You have to be putting in something to get something back out of it. And, and if you look at people that are successful, they probably have consistent, consistent patterns. If someone, someone looked at your life, would they say that you are a consistent person? Are you consistent in these things? Are you disciplined? Um, also, are you, the other word is, are you dedicated? Dedicated people win. Dedicated people get things done. Dedicated people make things happen. And so are you consistent and are you dedicated? If you are these two things, then you are guaranteed for success. But on the flip side, if you are not these things, you are guaranteed for failure. So I'm going to give you three tips today to help you. <clears throat> First of all, become focused. Get focused. Focus brings Clarity. Clarity equals power. Uh, the more you are on top of your goals and your dreams, the more you will be consistent. So I want to make sure that uh, you are focused. Focused. Um, number two, think long term. Consistent and dedicated people think long term. They don't think about what I'm doing um, right now and it doesn't work out. I'm just going to quit. People, they don't think like that. They think long term. Um, for instance, I have a lot of people now, a lot of our, our business, I feel like is done on social media nowadays. So if you are building an audience on social media, you have to think for the long term. Think about being consistent in what you do or produce on social media. Think of your Facebook as your business. What are you putting on Facebook? Is it positive? Is it, is it something that people are want to be engaged in? Um, look at that as part of a reflection of you. If something comes through my newsfeed and it's negative or it's gross or it just immediately turns me off, guess what? I hide that person because I don't want that in my life. I don't want negativity in my life. So I, want, I challenge each and every one of you to go to your Facebook and clean up your Facebook. If there's not appropriate things on there, if they're not positive, if it's not portraying yourself as a successful business person, then you need to delete it. Um, so I would, that's something I want to challenge you to do, to clean up your Facebook. Um, you think of your Facebook as something that earns you some income. Okay. So clean it up, make sure it's appropriate. People want to see your kids. People want to see you happy. People want to see people, um, I don't know, sharing positive things. So clean up your Facebook a little bit. So that's just a little, that one's for free. Um, so anyways, short term people. Uh, do not make phone calls for a week or a day or a month and say, oh, this sensei thing didn't work out for me. No, they, they make, they figure out how they're going to make it happen, okay? So you got to figure out a way that you are going to make it happen. Think of this as a marathon, not a sprint. Think of it as for a long term. And also number three is create good patterns. You can look at people who are successful. You can look at their calendar and their calendar will show why they are successful, Okay, um, they have patterns that produces successful habits. They get up at the same time every morning. They they get up, they work out. Um, and I'm just using these some of these things for example, but those are just a few of the things. They have a morning pattern. They have a daily pattern. Things that they do each and every day that produces successful things in their life. So I want. 
So anyways, those are some thoughts I wanted to share with you today. Um, so um, let me, I'm just going to become focused, number one, become focused, think long term, and create good patterns, and you will be consistent and dedicated. Have a great day, everyone. I love and appreciate you. You're rocking your Sensi business. And if you need anything, please reach out to your sponsor, your director, uh, and I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.